you kill him? No, there was more than one killer. So? Again, apparently. Almost all of them. The play starts on very high adrenaline. Anita invites her stalker into her flat and we take it from there. Philip Ridley's writing is amazing. You go on an incredible journey when you read it, when you're working on it, when you're watching his writing. It's funny, it's biting, it has enormous emotional resonance with the audience and I think anyone coming to see it will get the unexpected, they will be dazzled by the performances and Phil's fantastic writing. Anita's damaged, high maintenance, volatile, passionate, distraught. Davy's a a young boy in his adolescence, full of fear and um, he's very troubled and, and bullied really and um, lonely. What about this man you met? He used to work on the vans, loading coats, handsome. He used to strip to the waist, always oh, muscles. I was absolutely thrilled that we're transferring. I think it's uh, something the West End needs at the minute. I just think it's extraordinary. It's like an epic poem about a very dark subject. This play is electric, it's fiery. You're cocooned in this room and you're gonna go with these two behemoths and you're gonna fight with them. I think everyone in the room is gonna feel a part of it and I think it will take you on a journey. We're living at a time right now of such terrible divisions in society all over again. It's wound around so that at the moment, hate crime is so prevalent again. In the last five years, hate crime against LGBT plus people has gone up by 78%. And Vincent River addresses that prejudice very, very clearly. I couldn't wait to work with Robert and Louise again, who was a ball at the park, and I was so excited to just get in the room with those guys again. And also the opportunity to work with Daniel Taranto as the producer, who's done some fantastic productions, and it's great to be a part of the team again. It's a play lit by lightning, and I wanted to bring that lightning in a bottle back in the room.